My biggest fear is this. If on November 3rd, whether Phil Murphy wins or loses, Phil Murphy is going to institute all kinds of vax passports and he's going to want to vaccinate our kids and he's going to try to force the issue um, because that's who he is and that's what he wants to do. Damn the science. Damn parental rights. That's what Phil Murphy's going to do. That's my biggest fear. We got to vote him out. We got to get people to come out and understand that this is this isn't this isn't time to uh, to to sit back and watch and see what happens. It's time for action, and it's time for everybody who wants to protect their kids to get out like-minded people to vote. And at least if Governor Murphy does those things that I fear that he'll do on November 3rd, at least Jack Cittarelli can undo it. And so I'm just letting people know, time it's time for action. It's time for action. The way Governor Murphy's going to do it is through executive order, because you couldn't get the legislature. My guess is you can't get the, well, you couldn't get the legislature prior to an election to vote for anything like that because they wouldn't get elected because there'd be a backlash. Mm -hmm. um, so they're going to wait until after the election before they do anything. So if Governor Murphy instituted a vax mandate today for kids in school and from kindergarten through uh, college, uh, I don't think he'd get elected. And he knows that. And he knows that's not the will of the people. So he's going to wait till, I, my feeling is, is he's going to wait to November 3rd to do whatever it is that he's going to do that he can't do before November 2nd and still win. And our legislature refused to meet, the, both the Senate and the Assembly refused to meet until after the election. We have a whole board date for voting after the election. And the only reason that you would wait until after the election is because whatever you're going to do then is so bad that you fear you wouldn't get reelected if you voted for it and did it before the election. Be aware. Be aware. We need to get people out and vote and realize that whatever it is that they're up to that they won't tell us about today has got to be really bad that they're going to wait till after an election. And what Jack can do is if it's done by executive order, he can rescind, rescind the executive order when he comes in. Or he can institute an executive order uh, around anything that the legislature does between the date of when until the date of the uh, Jack comes into office. I hope everyone just heard what you just said. The government Murphy is aware it's not the will of the people. And he's going to do it anyway.